Hey art friends, welcome to today's how-to. Today we'll be learning how to draw Frances, a fan-made smiling critter from Poppy Playtime. Let's get started first... with our eyes on a slight diagonal towards the top right. And on the right hand side, we're going to draw on the bottom of the eye, curving this line around and then up. We're going to move down on a slight diagonal in the center, curving this line back around and then over. Closing this off on the top now, from the corner, we're going to arch this line all the way up and then down on the right hand side. And then moving over to the left, let's replicate that, drawing in a nice big arch line, bringing that down towards the corner. In the center of both eyes now, we're going to draw in a small oval. Let's move down and draw in the mouth now. So in the corner, we're gonna draw in a small curved line. Moving over to the right, let's replicate that. Now let's close off the rest of the mouth. So on the top, we're gonna to draw in a curved line from left to right. And then dropping down, we're gonna draw in a nice big arch line. In the center for the tongue, we're gonna to curve this line up and down. And then to the right of this, we're gonna curve this line over towards the right. Before we draw in our face, let's draw in our right hand that's above. So coming across for the thumb, we're gonna curve this line up and then down. Moving across, we're gonna draw in a small curved line from left to right. And then in the center, we're just gonna arch this line down. For the first finger, we're gonna curve this line out and then in towards that line in the center. In the center, we're gonna curve this line up and then down. And then one more time, we're gonna arch this line up and then back in, ending this at the same height. Now from here, let's frame in the rest of the face. So coming up above for the cheek, we're gonna curve this line around and then in towards our thumb. And then coming underneath, we're gonna to continue to curve this line around and then in underneath the mouth. Let's move over to the left-hand side on a diagonal and we're gonna curve this line around and then back in on the bottom, blending that together. Closing off the top of the head now, on the left-hand side, we're gonna arch this line up and then down in the center. And then from that center line to the right of this, we're gonna curve this line up and then back down. We're gonna draw in a small circle on both sides. On the right hand corner, let's draw in another small circle and then we'll do the same thing over on the left. Now towards the left hand side, let's draw in the crown. So we're going to draw a diagonal line on the left hand side coming out, leaving quite a big gap coming over to the right from the center. We're going to draw a diagonal line up towards the top. Now from here on both sides, we're going to bring our diagonal line in towards the middle. And then from that center, we're gonna bring two more diagonal lines that come in towards the center, creating a small triangle. Let's draw on the eyebrows. So on the right-hand side, we're gonna curve this line down. And then on the left-hand side, we're gonna arch this line in. Now let's move underneath. And we're gonna start by drawing in the pendant in the center. So we're gonna draw in a curved line, arching that around and then up. And now from that point, we're gonna curve this line back around and then in. Let's draw on our left arm first. So over on the left-hand side, we're gonna curve this line up and over. And then stepping further in, we're gonna again curve that over towards the left-hand side. For the thumb, we're gonna curve this line out and then in. For the first finger, we're gonna curve this line out, back in. Moving up above, we're gonna curve this line around, back in. And then one more time, arching up, we're gonna curve that down in the corner. For the wrist, we're just gonna draw in a small curved line from top to bottom. And now let's draw in the rest of the body. So coming across on the right-hand side, we're gonna curve this line around, and then up underneath our left arm. And now from here, let's connect the arm to our hand. So from the corner, we're gonna curve this line around in towards our chin. 
Moving further down now, we're gonna curve this line around in towards the stomach. And then for the wrist, we're just gonna draw in another curved line from left to right. Now let's draw in our legs. So on the inside, we're gonna draw in a curved line that arches around and then down. And then we'll do the same thing on the right hand side, leaving a big gap in the center. On the outside line, we're gonna move further up, curving this line around and then in on both sides. Now from here on the bottom, we're gonna curve this line around and then up. For the first toe, we're gonna curve this line around and then down. Stepping further up, we're gonna curve this leg further out and then in. And then one more time, we're just gonna curve this line up and then down. And then from this corner, we're just gonna curve this line across, closing that off. And then for the ankle, we're just gonna draw in a small curved line from left to right. And that is it, that's how you draw Frances. You can pause the video and color it the way that I have done, or you can change your colors up if you'd like. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel, and also drop a comment below suggesting any more characters that you'd love to learn to draw next. Thanks so much for joining me on today's tutorial and I will see you all on the next one.